good morning and welcome to a home vlog. The baby just woke up from his nap, so we're gonna go upstairs and get the baby real quick. But we're gonna be hanging out at home today, doing all kinds of fun home vloggy type stuff. Who's ready? This guy. And right, Jackson's leading the way. Hi, Allison. <laughs> Hi, Sam. Look at this. He's like, he's like, what in the world? What is happening? Hey, oh, bud. Your nap. Don't squeeze How's your nap, little babes? <laughs> yeah, was it good? He's like, I am so <laughs> confused. Baby, As to what is going on. How's your silly nappy? How was your silly nappy go? How uh -huh. was your silly nappy? Look at his hair. I know. <laughs> Look at his hair. Yeah, I made it super quiet, right? You did great, buddy. You High five. Good, you're such a nice good big brother. Oh, ah. you missed. Try again. <laughs> 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 Do a high five, do a low five. Show me how strong you are. Oh, oh you missed it. No, that was a miss. No. Oh, almost. Try again. Right. That hurt your hand? <laughs> okay. Oh, no. Are you all right? Can I roll your fingers all off? We do this thing where we do high fives so he can show us how strong he is, and then all of our fingers fall off. We go, yeah. oh my gosh, you, you broke all my fingers off. Because you're so happy strong. Baby. Is that funny? Silly happy baby. Silly happy baby. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, He's poopy, like, babe. what? Hi, buddy. Poopy, 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 poopy. So today we have to run to the grocery store, which oh, yeah. we did. We got all of our Thanksgiving stuff. We talked to you guys Happy yesterday about. Happy Thanksgiving! Not, oh, yeah. not Happy close, Thanksgiving. close, buddy. We talked to you about all of the Thanksgiving prep that we have to do. So we went to the store and we got most of the things. And then we realized we forgot some like major things. So we have to go back to the store today. And I'm a little bit, buddy. <laughs> I'm a little bit nervous about going to the store today. What? Oh, because it's Sunday. Because it's the weekend before Thanksgiving. Before the, yeah. Oh, yeah. So we'll we see get, how that goes. Oliver got dressed and promptly went into Jackson's bed and fell asleep. No. Didn't fall asleep. He was just we put him in a cute pose. We were getting Jackson's clothes for the day. I the game. Okay, buddy, yeah. we were getting Jackson's clothes for the day. And I, sh I was showing him. So he has, Jackson has this Jelly Cat Cloud like pillow. Uh -huh. And we got the baby a mini version. So they have like matching Jelly Cats. And I was showing it to him, and he loved it. And then Jackson wanted to show him his Pluto, his sleeping Pluto. This yeah, was his it. first, like, Disney, well, ah. this was Jackson's first Disney plush. Oh, yeah. There's so much happening. Oh, my gosh. So, wait. Tell tell them about the book that you guys read last night. Oh, yeah. What to do with a problem? It's right there. Uh, it it fell down from, like, real this way. Oh, it rolled off like, the... It had, like, a little bit of... This corner a little bit down it fell. Oh, the egg light did. Your egg light, yeah. So wait, Jackson, do you remember this book that we read last night about what to do with a problem? Yeah. What is it about? Pro about the thing that makes you brave. Oh that yeah. Makes you brave. When you have a problem, what should you do? Try to find the problem. Yeah, face it head on. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And we did it this morning, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. What was yeah. your problem that you had to face? What was your problem that you had to face? <laughs> oh no, in the book. gonna suck him up. In the book. What was your problem? Uh, oh yeah, it was about like like I I couldn't eat the waffle. I ate, I ate a lot of it. I I left half and I feed the baby. Okay, that was a, that's probably more complex. <laughs> that's like when when you know what your kid is talking about, but nobody else does. So. This morning, in every morning, Jackson loves to help feed his baby brother. And Jackson also likes to pick out his, the baby brother's food. But this morning, Jackson was running a little bit behind, and so he hadn't eaten his waffle yet. And I told him he needed to eat his waffle before we worked together to feed baby brother. And that was his problem, because he wanted to feed baby brother first, but he needed to eat his waffle. So he was having big feelings about... Oh no, <laughs> Pluto's on your foot? He was having big feelings about... The fact that I was feeding baby brother before he was done with his waffle. Pluto foot! Pluto foot. But, so that was his problem that he had to work through. And it, the book actually helped us work through it. It was pretty great. No! The Pluto foot. Oh no. So this is it. What to do with a problem. And that's something we just got at the library. Yeah. And this is what he was talking about, how it was like a big black thing. Like this is his problem in the book. And it gets bigger and bigger and bigger because he tries to ignore it. And then he finally says, all right, I'm going to face it head on. And then he comes up with a solution and he faces it. And it turns out 
that it was a beautiful because it's a key it looks like yeah it led to an opportunity and then oh. everything was good was he knew key? the secret and now he wasn't afraid of problems anymore was that key that's the key to it i have a confession to make the ugly truth is i was originally against amazon devices oh like, i was too because they're listening to you all the time yeah stuff like that but now that we have a couple i got one for free from destination d23 a couple of years ago <laughs> and that opened the door i blame uh josh tomorrow <laughs> for giving away well but also you got it and then they didn't actually give it to you for like three years yeah so i didn't it took a I long never, time i never thought we were going to actually get it but then we got it and now I really enjoy it because we can play music through it and I can talk to her and Jackson likes asking her knock-knock jokes and things like that but she's not very good she gets a lot of things wrong <laughs> and she messes up a lot but we have two of them now we bought a second one now they're in stereo and we can listen to music and we've been listening to more music on them and I like that I like that our house is now filled with music often. Well, it was always filled with music though because we had the 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 record player. The record player, but now. Now we don't use the record player as much. Oh, this lady. <laughs> Look at this little baby sitting up so good. Oh, as no, he falls as he over. Falls. You're doing so great, bud. I'll give him all the space. <laughs> little babe. Oh, you can see how good he is. I sorry, I just like put water in his hair. That's why it looks like this. Oh, we were, like... yeah, we were talking about like how would we style his hair? His hair sticks up straight. Um, it's down right now because Tim put some water in it, but normally it sticks just straight up. He has a little, like, little fuzzy baby head. What is he head. doing with his feet? He's feeling the rug. Oh, okay. What does the rug feel like? Let me ask you guys this. So he army crawls. We yeah. want him to, like, I know that not every baby will fully crawl, like a normal crawl. I don't know if we actually showed his army crawl. Did we oh. show it? You want to do an army crawl, buddy? You want to show everybody how you crawl around? It, Let's see it. He's really good, though. He's very quick with his army crawl. Yeah, here, Oliver, come get this. But he is, I think it's his shorts. <laughs> I need to pull his shorts up. He's Does gonna he crawl, out? he's gonna crawl right out of his shorts. But, he, <laughs> but he's very quick. Like he's, he's very good at maneuvering with his little army crawl. So like my question was, how do we get him to like go up on arms I don't, and, knee, I don't, and knees? I don't think we, ha we need to. I think we've tried to like get him to, to position himself up on his, I think he's just kind of like a little bit lazy. Some babies are. Jackson was a lazy eater. Yeah. He would like start eating and just fall asleep immediately. Yeah. Oliver, hard time eating. Lazy crawler. Lazy crawler. But I think that it's definitely like sometimes this is just the the next step is just standing up and walking. They just go from this to that. Huh. So. Well, there you go. Babies are different. Some babies. It's some not babies a race. Bump shuffle. <laughs> yeah. Some roll. It is a race. A baby race. So speaking of the Amazon assistant. We just got these on Black Friday. It was like an early Black Friday deal. We're gonna hang them over top of the pool and it's gonna be great because Christmas time, right? And these are Govi multicolored, shatterproof, dimmable, waterproof cafe lights. So in the adventures of uh, having to buy things for school, we had to get Jackson dress shoes for a thing that's coming up and we got him penny loafers. Why are they called penny loafers? Why would you put a penny in them? Are you supposed to put a penny in them? Or is that just like the name of them? Because I've seen people with pennies, the style is like wearing an onion on your belt. I've seen people with pennies in them, but are you supposed to wear a penny in them? Or is that like, they're called like penny loafers because they only cost a penny. It said back in the 1930s, the loafer design allowed just enough space for a penny in each shoe. The perfect hiding spot for a little payphone change in the That's age before long, mobile phones. a long time ago, he had those old, old shoes. Who did? Daddy did? Yeah. Which My shoes? shoes were old? Yeah. You mean on the cruise? The only time he wears dress shoes is on the cruise. What what shoes? Mine are super special. Oh, those your Those are your Ciccones. Yeah, they're, those are cool. I wish I had every, a pair. Everybody's shoes are super special. Yeah. <laughs> they are, they that's are. true. You out there, your shoes, special. Yeah. yeah All right, it's lunchtime for everybody. What are we having for lunch today, bud? Hi. Hi, what are we having for lunch today? Um, Some of turkey sandwich. Um, I didn't like it cut off four and a half, I only like, like it cut in two halves. Oh, well, I put it in fours to make it easier for you to eat. Is that okay? Oh, yeah. And then next time I'll cut it in twos for you. We're having some pretzel goldfish, some turkey and cheddar sandwich, 
Uh, the applesauce. Oh, this is the one that's it's called Gimme Five. It has all five flavors. Let's see what flavors are we. We are apple, mango, strawberry, peach, and banana. That sounds yummy. And then the baby is having winter squash. Winter what? squash and, and sweet cream, sweet corn, and green beans. That's right, buddy. <laughs> this is my favorite thing. So when the baby eats, he loves food. He's a big, big foodie, a big baby foodie. But when he's eating, he'll watch. <laughs> You're such a good eater. Yeah, good job, bud. Very good. So we were planning on going to the grocery store. Thank you. We we're planning on going to the grocery store. We haven't done that yet. Ah, there's a lot of salt. It does have a lot of salt. So that's why you don't get very many of those goldfish because they are pretty high in sodium. What's the deal with like the, yes, what's the dad, deal? Dad, dad gave me a lot of goldfish. I did give him a lot yesterday. Sorry. You had a lot of goldfish? Yes, oh no, that daddy. But what's the deal with kids' food being so high in sodium and so high in sugar? Like, yeah, even they just, just like kids. too uh, much salt. Yeah. yeah. Guess what? It's not just kids' food. Yeah, the adult food is too. So, yeah. It's baby food, that's it. Baby food. Baby food is literally just this. Just the ingredients. Baby food organic has organic winter salt. squash. One yeah. ingredient. So, there you go. We're just going to be eating jarred baby food from here on out. Yeah. But, um, not really. But we need to go to the grocery store still. Why does Oliver not like bananas? Well, so Oliver had bananas one time and it made him so sick. No, it was twice. It happened oh, twice. twice. Yeah, he, um, that's right. So Oliver had bananas a few times <laughs> and... Look, they lost salt. I see that, buddy. And it made him, it just really upset his tummy and he was, he was sick from the bananas. So we stopped giving him bananas, but like, when do you try again? Cause I know it's something that you're supposed to try again. I just don't know when to try again because obviously I don't want the baby to be sick, but I don't know. So have you guys had this issue with your baby and when did you try the food again? So let me know in the comments below. I'm interested to see like how other people have dealt with it and how, or, you know, did your babies have an issue with banana? Cause I guess banana is kind of a big one. So we're doing lunch really quick right now with the kids. And then we're going to run out and go to the grocery store and run some errands. And uh, yeah, this is, this is our weekend. This is what we do on the weekends. Super exciting stuff. So uh, we actually just got back from the grocery store and I'll talk to you guys about that in just a second. But one thing I wanted to point out is we got this a while ago. It was like $2. It's tape. That looks like a road. And it still sticks. sticks. Right? Yeah. And so we got it for Jackson to race his Hot Wheels on. And so now I've set up a little track now here's the app. around what? the road. Yeah, and then this is as far as it went. So it's not yeah. a lot of tape. Yeah, and it's not very wide just, either. There's so much tape that it just died out. Yeah. So let's see. Let's race your cars down it. See how a Hot Wheels fits on that track. Now here you go. Now okay. let's race. Oh yeah, look at that. They, they don't now fit side I'm by side. Going in front of you. But so you'll be behind me. Okay. You try to beat me. Okay, we'll do. Here you go, Jackson. Here's a fun fact about a DeLorean. If you find a DeLorean that's painted, they didn't actually sell DeLoreans painted. They were just the silver brushed uh, stainless steel. And so if you find one that's painted, more than likely, it See, is. It's back fields are painted. Oh yeah, it's it's worth less. <laughs> Because it's, it's been painted. It's really like, have like those square, square back, back lights. Oh yeah. And the front lights are just like, like blue. Oh, gotcha. There are only three vehicles that were ever painted from DeLorean. And yeah. the, one of them actually got stripped down and two of them are still left. But those are some of the most valuable DeLoreans out there. But that's why I said there's only, there's only ever three of them and only two remain. So, more than likely, if you find a painted DeLorean, it was painted by the dealer or by the individual and is worth less than a stainless steel DeLorean. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I said. Here you go. This is a blue DeLorean. So, like I said, we just got back from the grocery I store. Have, I have the cube on my eye. Oh, there, yeah. You, it went to mine. Your eye. <laughs> like I said, we just got back from the grocery store. And I don't that, know if it's my it's old age. My and on, it's oh. on my eye. It's on your eye. Or if it's just like oh, having that, kids in general, eye, Dad. but like the, oh, the grocery my, store oh, now is. is so much more chaotic the, than before we had kids. There it is, in your eye. And it might just be this. Just jumped in from my eye. It might just be this. 
But like I, today at the grocery store, I was like, what is happening right now? It feels like there's people everywhere. It feels like we're in everybody's way and like stuff was all gone. And I understand it's like the, the Sunday before Thanksgiving, but like, I don't know. Grocery store was wild. That's why I didn't film anything in the grocery store because I was kind of like overwhelmed with what was happening. Yeah. Yeah. Cause you tried to get the toasters, but I think that, that it costs too much money for you. The toasters? Yeah. The little toast, toast pieces. Yeah. Well, little tiny pieces of bread. We found them. Yeah. We couldn't find them at first. They were just hidden. Yeah, they were near the eggs. They were near. Cheese. They were near the eggs and cheese. I don't think that's true. I the think cheese. that is. They were near the cheese. <laughs> what uh? What else did we get at the grocery store? Anything hmm. interesting? Oh yeah, I got three cars. You got three cars. I can show you guys. I'll show you the three cars. Okay, let's show them. Got show them to me. Gasser. It's pass this is just like this a one's, Chevy. This one's called Pass and Gasser. Oh yeah, this one's the classic 55 Nomad. He Which, said it, what did you say it looked like? It looked like a Corvette, but it's a Chevy. It does, yeah. I don't know if it looks like a Corvette. It does look like a Chevy though. Yeah. Yeah. And then what else? What's the last one that you got? This is oh, a Hyundai. Close. What? A Subaru. Well, the one with the stars, what is it Subaru. called? Oh yeah, the one with the stars. You know what it's called? It's called Subaru Brat. And then that's part of the snowy thing, snowy... They had like a whole... A snowy concert. Yeah, it's like the snowy... Oh, it's got like a, like a snowman. It's like their winter thing. And then this one is yeah. part of their and wagons. The and this one's part you of the gassers. You do have the Mini Cooper. So they, they have a Mini Cooper so snowy one that one he got. Of, one of them that we don't have is, is a Nissan. And one of them that we don't have is, a, is, a, is this oh. guy. What is that guy? That's the Subaru. That's the Subaru. Subaru WRX. Yeah. That's the one you have. Oh, no, that's the WRX. You don't have that one. There's the Mini Cooper you have. The S Challenge. The Lancer, a Mitsubishi and Lancer. One. And the carb Carbonator you have, but we haven't opened it yet. Yeah. Oh, and then yeah. there's another one that's a Carbonator. Pass and Gasser. Pass and Gasser, yeah. <laughs> you have a Carbonator, which is actually it's an interesting car because it's also a bottle opener and can opener. Yeah, it's like a, it's meant to look like a soda bottle. Yeah. Yeah, but it's he, like a soda bottle. It is Remember like Remember when we had that regular one? That was not the one. No, the we one still that, have it. The it's new not, it's, one, the new one is it's for 2024. It's like a yeah, New Year's yeah. car. It's, it's the New Year guy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Which, speaking of New Year's, I'm pretty excited to like so, celebrate with Jackson because we can, can do like yeah. he can he can tell us his 12 wishes for the grapes. Oh yeah, we can do New Year's like noon. Yeah. So do what? you? Who's in a parade? Who's in the parade? Oh, sorry, buddy. You got to think of your 12 wishes for New Year's. Twelve witches? Yeah, do you have twelve, 12 witches? Twelve witches? Do you have twelve wishes? Now? You can't think of twelve things that you want or want to do? Oh, yeah. Oh, a scavenger hunt. You, you want to do a scavenger it? hunt? Yeah. Oh. I love that idea. Okay. And, um... Where do you go with scavenger play? hunt? I don't know. Let's play, oh. let, let's play New Year Happies. New, New Year's Happies? happies. Yeah. Wait, so can you think of any other things you want to do for the new year? Yeah. Like any places you want to go? Where do you want to go? Where do you want to go? You want to play golf? Okay. Yeah, we talked to some friends about going and playing golf with them. Where else? <laughs> he wants to go on a vacation with one of our friends, so maybe we'll do that. Where else? And, and I want to poop on mommy. You want to poop on mommy? <laughs> okay. It <could> probably happen. <laughs> what, any any like places that you want to go or things you want to do? Uh, I want to play with Oliver. You want to play with Oliver? I bet you'll do that in a lot in 2024. Do you want to go, like, is there any special rides you want to ride? Oh, yeah. I found a special ride. What? Hot Wheels ride. Oh, so there is actually a Mattel theme park that's opening up in Arizona um, that's going to have a Hot Wheels roller coaster. Yeah. Maybe we'll go there. Oh, We have some friends that live there, so maybe Am we'll I go there. Am I old enough? I think so. Probably. Yeah. yeah. It's for, I think it's like a kid, so four kids. You're 42 inches, so that's pretty much everything. Yeah. Yeah, because I... I'm even 42 inches. I know. Yeah. I think I'm even taller than that. You now. want to measure yourself? Yeah. Let's do it. Okay, so we have our measurements on this here wall here. I want to get like okay. a special thing because they're really just kind of scribbled on the wall. Nice and nice and straight. Don't do tippy toes looking up. He's cheating. <laughs> All right, I think that's look up. Look up here. There you go. All right. It is. See. Look at this distance between the last time that we measured him. We gotta do this is so it's a little bit taller. So messy. We need to we need to do it like in an actual line. That's not how it works. Yes, you it do is. Do what you want to do. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit taller than that. Are you? So how how tall are they? 
Oh my goodness gracious, buddy. You are now 42 and 5 eighths. Whoa. Holy That's man. a tall one. Yeah. That is a tall one. You're a tall one. 42 and 5 eighths. Look at this tall buddy. So check this out. On first glance, what is that? It's a blueberry pie? Incorrect. It is a cookie cake. So this is a chocolate chip cookie that they designed at the grocery store to look like a blueberry pie. Amazing. You guys know I just had to get this. So it has been an eventful evening. So we went grocery shopping. Yes. And we got mostly everything that we need for Thanksgiving, but there are a few things we're gonna have to go back for. So we all we usually make like chips and dip, like chips and French onion dip, but they were totally out of chips. Like the chips were gone. So, oh, you're so cute. Um, and then we need to get like drinks, like water and um, whatever soft drinks and stuff. And oh, and the rest of the stuff for our uh, cheese and meat plate, which we do every year now. I feel like it's a yearly thing now. Yeah, it's happened once, and now it's a yearly no, thing. No, twice. Is it twice? Yeah. Okay. So yeah, that that's what it takes to make it annual. It's like two times, and then it's annual, yeah. right? Okay. Yeah. So, but I wanted that to be like very fresh. So that's gonna be the uh, the next time we go to the store. <laughs> but Jackson, um, this was so weird. So Jackson, are you okay? <laughs> okay. I don't know if you guys have seen the baby laugh, but he's very like he laughs at everything. He laughs so much. <laughs> and he has that's his laugh. <laughs> he's so funny. <laughs> He laughs at like this so much. <laughs> <laughs> you are so cute. Hey. Hey. But so we came back from the store and Jackson sat down on the couch. And uh, he, I was like, are you okay? Because he looked kind of like, almost like tired, you know? And I was like, are you okay? And he was fine at the store. Like we picked out his birthday cake and we picked out his cakes, his, his uh, cupcakes he's going to bring to school. And we got stuff for Thanksgiving that he was excited about. And he came home and yeah, he just seemed kind of, kind of tired. And he said, my head, hurt, my head hurts. And I was like, like a headache. But he, sorry, he doesn't know what a headache is. He's never had a headache before. So it was, I had to, we had to kind of explain it to him. And he did, he had a headache like here at the top of his head. Cause I know the different places that you have a headache means different things. And so, um, so yeah, he had this first little headache. Yeah. I don't know why. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know like what gives people headaches. We have had a ton of rain recently, and I know like the berry, uh, bariatric, bariatric, bari barometric, barometric. The pressure can can uh, make people react in different ways. So he just went. To, he said he wanted to go to bed early, so he's asleep now. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I don't know. It was interesting. His very first headache. So we're gonna hope that he feels okay in the morning. Hi, buddy. But other than that, he was totally fine. Whoa. Yeah. But we also like got... running around, having fun, and he's just like, eh, I got a headache. Yeah. I don't know. It was just interesting. I can't remember the first time I got a headache. Right. Like, I can't remember my... I don't remember that. But, yeah. So, whoa, buddy. Um, but we also got... <laughs> this baby is so wiggly. We also got this. So this is kind of like a little fidget board, right? It's got switches and knobs and things like that for them to switch on and off and it turns on lights and things like that and it's got just the alphabet on the back but yeah i thought that was neat i thought it was a neat thing for them to be able to play with I think and of we course just got it on amazon right yeah and so this, i'll, this I'll will, link it down below in case you guys are interested in it but yeah the baby loves it too and this will be 100 percent supervised when they're doing it but. oh yeah you want to see he doesn't quite understand switches yet but we will <laughs> i'm sure i'll get it pretty quick well, he, he sort of understands because he watched me do it and then he tried to do it, but I don't know if he's strong enough. He's like so excited. You hear him breathing? He's so excited. He's like, ah! These are a little bit like, like you need to put some pressure on them. This one I think you can do. Try. This is the other thing that's interesting. Watch, watch this. Oops, oh no, buddy. So watch his, his hand, right? When he points at stuff, he uses his middle finger. Yeah. Do you see him? Do you, do you see, see it? Oh, oh, hold on. Punching us. Hold on. Wait, this. Look at this. Look at this, bud. Oliver. Watch his finger. Watch his middle finger. Oliver, look right here. Look, look, look. 
Look right here. Look, look. Can you he see? Kind of did it just there. But he, it's so funny to watch. He, he literally uses his yeah, middle finger for everything. <laughs> yeah. Are you okay? <laughs> what are you trying to do? Are you okay? Are you trying to get to daddy? <laughs> yeah, I think so. So I still have to make us dinner. I don't know. Do you, are you hungry? Not entirely, no. Mm. We did have a public sub after we went to Publix. We got the turkey cranberry holiday sub. It was not as good as I remember it being. Was yeah, I it? feel like it was just okay. Yeah, it wasn't bad. Like it was, it was good, but it just wasn't as good as I remember it. So I don't know, but it's it was like turkey, <laughs> buddy. He... He's trying to get to the camera. <laughs> what are you doing? He just we... like wants to hold the camera. Here you go, bud. You oh. hold... Whoa! <laughs> go for the lens. You want to hold it here? Let me see this. Here. Who's that baby? Who is that baby? I don't know. Maybe not the lens. <laughs> no, no, not the lens. <laughs> He's gonna stop it recording. No, don't. Oh, very blurry now, buddy. <laughs> but you can see look he's using his middle finger like what who does is that like a normal thing i'm sure it is but it's just so funny that he doesn't use his pointer finger you're an interesting child you really are it's just so funny like how different they are like he's totally different than uh jackson was as a baby okay okay don't hurt daddy it's just interesting how different they are oh no all right a little while later and we're all eating dinner what are you having milk <laughs> Oops, I spilled it on his hand. so we've been having a hard time uh feeding he's he's like not wanting to eat my milk and then when he does have my milk i feel like i'm just not producing enough maybe because he hasn't been eating it right so we've been trying to give him formula but he will not drink out of a bottle and we've purchased there like every bottle known to man we have purchased we purchased some that were like look like boobs you know and they have I, I thought those would be the ones that would work honestly because they they're called emulate and i thought for sure they would work but they didn't <laughs> so now we're spoon feeding him formula and that seems to work he just doesn't like the bottle like the nipple on the bottle which makes it a little bit tough but i also made dinner for us so i did make some almond butter tofu with uh chili ginger ginger chili sauce and sushi rice with some radishes this is swiss chard and carrots it's very good i'm it was like fairly easy to make but yeah so that's kind of what's happening this is sort of what the weekends are like though there's just a lot of chaos the house is a wreck so as soon as the kids go to bed i have to like do the dishes try to figure out the laundry try to clean up the kitchen after dinner <laughs> um just clean up everything that's like everywhere all the cars like all the baby toys just everything you know that's what happens on a sunday so this is kind of a look at a real sunday for us you know it's happening yeah we also don't... i slept wrong so now i can't like turn my head correctly oh no i didn't sleep wrong we've been trying to get jackson to go to sleep on his own yeah he wants somebody to lay in the bed with him and right. i'm totally fine doing that like i love him but at some point he does need to learn to like fall asleep on his own he's done it before <laughs> he used to sleep on his he own used yeah. to sleep on his own but now he decided that he doesn't want to right um and so he's like, lay with me. And so I was like, every time that I lay down with him, I fall asleep. Mm -hmm. And I don't want to fall asleep. There's like too much to do. And so I tried like keeping my head up and I still fell asleep and then I hurt my neck. Oh no. <laughs> so because I'm still trying to feed the baby as much as I can, like my milk, I put the baby to sleep. Jackson puts, or <laughs> Jackson puts him to sleep, which is kind of true. Tim puts Jackson to sleep. So we kind of split the nighttime duties. But the baby usually goes to sleep sooner than Jackson, although he does wake up multiple times before Jackson actually goes to bed. So yeah, I don't know. This is this is a Sunday, you guys. Hi, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna eat um, really quick so that I can then clean everything up. Dad, dad, dad. He's gonna put the baby to bed tonight because Jackson's already asleep. And I don't, who knows how long he's gonna stay asleep. I don't know. But he's doing okay now. He seems to be very soundly asleep, so that's great. So yeah, and then we just head on into Monday, and that's how it is. Yeah. So yeah, um, hopefully you enjoyed this this real life look at our weekends. So okay, I'm gonna eat dinner. I'll be back. All right. So it's the end of the evening. We cleaned up. 
the laundry's put away, the dishes are done, uh, the toys are put away. Still some more things we gotta do, but that's a Monday problem. Ooh. <laughs> you know what I wanna do? What? I wanna hang those lights outside. Right now? Chill- oh man, I've been like, it's been eating away at me. It's 11 o'clock at night. I know. I don't think you should do it right mm, now. They've been eating away at me. <laughs> so we got those cafe lights. We showed you them earlier that were like the, the um, Christmas colors. We're going to hang them up in regular light colors, you know, yeah. like, like white, you know? Yeah. But I don't think right now is a good time. Man. Eating. Eating away at me. Tomorrow. All right. Tomorrow yeah. it is. <laughs> I can just see you out there with like a ladder in the dark by the pool. Yeah. With electricity. Yeah. It's perfect. <laughs> it sounds it's, like a recipe. It's, it's the best time to do it. <laughs> 11 o'clock at night with a hurt neck That definitely in the dark. sounds like a Tim thing though. Yeah. You know? Barefoot. Right. That's I would like to put them up before Thanksgiving so that we can like hang out outside. Yeah. And we have lights out there because we have fans with lights, but... We have this like newly renovated patio area and the family hasn't seen it yet. So I would like for it to be very, you know, like nice for yeah. them, for yeah. us too, but. Cool. So I think it's time to go to bed. This video kind of like morphed into a, uh, what our weekends look like now that we're oh. parents. Parents of two. Yeah. Your weekends used to look much different. Yeah. They really did. We literally have Barbie on the Apple TV and I'm like, we should watch that. But we don't have time to. Yeah, I really, really want to see it. I haven't seen it yet. You know what else I really want to see is the the Ballad of Songbird and Snakes, the Hunger Games movie. Yeah. I want to see that. Um, there was something else too that I really wanted to see. It was like a, what? I want you to watch Loki. Oh yeah, I want to watch that. Ooh, so good. I know. There's so many things. I just don't have time. Yeah, it's true. Uh, parenting. Good times. <laughs> But speaking of parenting, yeah. we should go to sleep so that yes. we can wake up in the middle of the night. Well, I have a feeling that Jackson is going to wake up super early because he went to bed super early. Yeah. So we got to get ready for that. He's going to come running in at 5 a.m. and be like, all right, it's party time. He's going to be like, I'm awake. Like, all right. Okay, bud. I try to tell him, like, the sun's not awake. So you, you can't, you know, you can be awake, like read some books in bed, you know, but we, we're not going to get up until the sun's up. And he's like, I'm awake. Yeah. I don't know about you guys, but I'm awake now. <laughs> so, we need to go to sleep in yeah. that case. Yeah, yeah. So, all in all, it was a fantastic day. With that being said, we are off. We'll see you all tomorrow. And now, now it's time, time to pay, pay the, the price. price.